Welcome to Power Code Music. In this video, we're going to talk about the Tascam DP24 digital multi-track recorder and why I use it. Actually, the answer to that question is pretty simple. Years before most people bought their current digital audio workstations, Tascam had put together a complete package with everything you need to record and produce great music. That sounds good. And so after that those digital audio workstations are no longer valid or useful, Tascam's units will still be doing the same thing. And that is one of the major reasons why I use it. See, I've been recording music since the 70s, and I've used just about every technology that you can think of uh, up to now to keep doing that. Now, I have also tried to use the, uh, or definitely use the Cakewalk systems from its inception all the way through Sonar, which Gibson subsequently purchased and nosedived. So my worst fears were realized when that happened because all of my music was landlocked on that system. Now I've been working in IT for decades, so that was one of my worst fears in regards to having my music on either a Windows or OS platform. And so with these digital audio workstation packages, uh, all the popular ones um, or in the higher end ones will either work on one of those two uh, systems. So for the most part, uh, those comes with, they come with a lot of pitfalls. Number one, a lot of OS changes that you have to keep up with, uh, version upgrades for both sets of software, your digital audio workstation packages and your uh, Mac or OS systems. You got your hardware restrictions, you got your, you know, your hardware upgrades that you're going to need to use to keep up with your horsepower. You got to contend with viruses, security issues. Uh, in many cases, a lot of the, the digital audio workstations are very complicated to use. Some of the manuals are thousands of pages. And if you're using some of the higher end systems, your continual version upgrades are uh, expensive. Is That's an added cost each time you want to upgrade. And those upgrades might come along with changes where you may need to relearn the system for some of the popular functionality that you use. You know, I grew up with tape recorders. They were simple and I need to get back to something that was as simple as that and easy to use. And so with that, I took had to take a look at, you know, back at Tascam, you know, the king of the multi-track hardware <laughs> recorder. And so the Tascam DP24 does it all. It comes in the 24 and 32 track versions. Now they're compact, they're all in one, and you know, they're, they're the easiest multi-track units to use on the market, hands down. With that, um, it works with your PC. Um, the older uh, hardware units, which is the ones I have, they come with MIDI and a CD tray, which uh, CD uh, ROM drive, which are awesome. And so um, they also have SD cards, uh, which they record onto, and they have a USB drive, which you can connect to your computer. Um, the recording is easy for these systems, <laughs> extremely easy. You just plug in uh, what you want to record. You um, basically adjust your um, input. Your, you select your input, adjust your assign, um, adjust your trim, and you have auto punch in, auto punch out, everything that you would expect in me. It has easy song and track management. You can um, edit um, the tracks on your songs. You can cut, copy, uh, clone, delete, move, everything that you bounce, everything that you would need to manage your tracks and also get more tracks out of the 24 or 32 track units. These units are flexible. Um, once you fill up your 24 tracks, you can actually mix down up to 32 tracks because the eight inputs on the back of the unit can be used to input other devices that you can then add to your overall two track mix down. Now, in effects, it's awesome. It has um, a special input for guitar effects where you can simulate amplifiers, pedals, um, anything you need. The overall unit has all the effects that you could possibly ever want. Choruses, delays, compressor, compressors, um, reverbs, uh, EQ for everything, you know, and more. And they have presets that are professionally set that you can apply to just about everything. It's just awesome. And then once you get your mix down done, the unit has additional functionality, which is called mastering. It takes your two track mix down to the next level. It adds, a di you can add additional preset compression, EQ, um, uh, additional audio processing that takes your uh, music to an additional higher broadcast quality, which everybody wants. 
it is fantastic easy to use now the firmware instead of messing around with windows and macintosh upgrades to your system that are just cumbersome time you know time consuming and can cause other issues in some cases the upgrade of the firmware for the dp24 is easy now what you do is you can plug the dp24 into your computer via the usb and it turns into a usb drive now with that there's a folder that you just take the patch that Tascam, the upgrade patch file that Tascam provides to you, drop it into the utilities folder, and then you reboot the DP24 holding down two buttons. It'll go into um, upgrade mode. You push yes, and in a couple minutes, your system's upgraded. And Tascam's uh, releases for this are periodic, and even without, the system's very reliable. And so moving on to you know the final part of this, your system is reliable. It was kicking butt and doing everything you needed to record years ago and years after your current system is done, it's going to be doing the same thing. Now here's the one Achilles heel of the system. If you're looking at the new DP24 SDs, which is the latest and greatest version that Tascam have released, it doesn't have MIDI and it doesn't have a CD-ROM drive. Now that is a mistake that Tascam made. If anything, Tascam put the MIDI back on the system. See, I have two systems in my, city, in my studio, and I sync them together to use one big system via MIDI. And also, you can hook up, for instance, a drum machine and sync your drum machine to your DP24 and anything else that has MIDI uh, to your DP24, sequencers on your keyboards, anything else. Um, if you have the older unit, the pre-SD units, which I have. So Tascam, put it back that was the one big mistake that they made on the system but anyway it doesn't diminish at all why i use the system because again i use the older one but if you're looking for one you might want to consider maybe trying to find an older one too but if you stay tuned i am going to do a review of the unit in a in a later video so but for the most part that is why i use it because this system is compact easy to use sounds great and it's gonna be around long af after most of these digital audio workstations are long gone. So, that's about it. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and leave your comments in the comment section below. Please subscribe to the channel, click the subscribe button on your screen right now and join our group. We have new videos coming out every week. Now, hey, while you're at the channel, look around at some of the other videos, listen to the music and let me know what you think. I'm really interested. I am so happy that you stopped by. Thank you for stopping by, and I look forward to seeing you soon.